It was July 15, 1941. The versatile actor Frank Morgan, best known for his iconic role as the wizard in The Wizard of Oz, found himself in the midst of a whimsical case of mistaken identity in the bustling streets of New York City. On the evening of July 15, Frank Morgan was strolling through Times Square, enjoying the vibrant atmosphere of the city that never sleeps. Dressed in a stylish suit, he blended in with the crowd, seemingly just another face in the bustling metropolis. As he approached a busy intersection, a group of enthusiastic tourists spotted him and an excitement rippled through their midst. To their delight, they believed that they had encountered none other than the wizard himself. In a burst of enthusiasm, they approached Frank with a wide-eyed excitement, requesting autographs and expressing the admiration for his magical performance in The Wizard of Oz. Frank, ever the good-humored entertainer, decided to play along with the case of mistaken identity. With a twinkle in his eye, he graciously signed autographs or regaled about the group with tales of Oz, spinning whimsical stories that left his newfound fans in stitches of laughter. Word quickly spread through the crowd, and soon a growing throng of people gathered around Frank Morgan, all convinced that they were in the presence of the wizard. Passerby joined in the fun, snapping photos and eagerly participating in the impromptu spectacle. Delightful... The delightful charade continued for a good while, with Frank Morgan embracing the unexpected role of the wizard on the streets of New York. Eventually, as the laughter echoed through Times Square, Frank bid farewell to his adoring fans, leaving behind trails of smiles and fond memories. The incident became a legendary tale of good-natured humor and spontaneity, showcasing Frank Morgan's ability to turn an ordinary evening into an extraordinary magical experience for those lucky enough to cross his path in the heart of the city.